With styles ever changing, my style changing, I thought it was about time to make over this living room. So let's change this room from farmhouse to a more cozy, modern feel. Hey guys, it's Jess. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are in my living room. This has been a long awaited makeover. I spend a lot of time here on YouTube looking at so much beautiful inspiration. For me, farmhouse is out of style. That being said, as always, do what style you love. If you love farmhouse, do farmhouse. If you love retro, do retro. All that matters is that your home feels like home to you. Let's talk about my space. When we first moved in two years ago, this living room was painted an ugly green color. Don't get me wrong, I love a good green moment, but this green made the room feel so small. Already an awkward space, I needed to make it look pretty while still being functional. I painted the walls white. At the time, I loved shiplap. I wanted a good shiplap moment. Gotta love Joanna Gaines. I also loved the brick on the fireplace, but I felt like it was too red at the time. So I decided to do a white wash over the whole thing to make it more neutral and blend more into the shiplap walls. Now tying in with the brick fireplace, I wanted to add some more brick to the rest of the room. So let me show you. I made over this archway with some DIY brick. I will insert a clip of it here. After doing a few of these changes, we lived in the space for almost two years. I think it was about time for me to do over this space and make it feel more like me now, two years later. And I wanted to do this makeover while on a budget. I did not want to spend a bunch of money on it, so I looked around my house to find things that might go with the style I'm looking for. So let's go back and show you the style that I am looking for. Before we moved into this house, the previous owners redid the kitchen and they left the cabinets in the garage that they were not using. Thankfully for me, I got these doors off of the cabinets. They're these really pretty wooden doors um, with some really pretty handles on them that could definitely be upcycled. So I took these and put them up to the TV stand and they fit perfectly. So this is what we're going to use on my new TV stand and I'm so excited. I had to paint the top of the TV stand while my husband was home because the TV is so heavy that it takes two people to move it. So since he's out of work at nighttime, that's when I started painting the top of the TV stand. It is in the color Noir. I think that's how you say it in Valspar. So that I can put the handles at the top. I'm gonna line it up with the edge. So I made a little jig so that I can make sure that the all of the doors are lined up correctly. this all-in-one paint and primer metallic finish metallic gold spray paint this color hopefully and I'm going to paint the knobs the poles for the cabinet I wanted to add some texture to this stand so I thought that using some caning would be beautiful however caning is super expensive I did have some burlap from a previous project in my craft room, so I thought this would have a similar effect to give it that texture that I wanted. Thank you. 
Okay, so I have cut all the frames for each of the doors and I put them together to make sure that they fit. Now I'm going to glue them together and put them on the cabinet. Okay, so I have put all of the trim for each door together. I glued them with some hot glue and wood glue so that it's easier for me to take them and kind of just place them on the cabinets instead of having to, you know, measure put one side on, put the other side on, and then connect them. So they are all dry now. Um, I taped them with some blue tape and then I'll take this off and we're going to paint them before I place them on the doors. And then after that's done, we will be able to paint the entire cabinet. Now this has been a crazy process, but I am so excited for the outcome. All right, the hard part is done. Now let's do the most exciting part and decorate.
definitely the transformation that I needed. It feels so much more cozy and a little bit more moody. Of course, there's still a few things that I want to change. I want to change out the shiplap for maybe a paint or wallpaper. Not really sure yet, and it's not really in the budget, so we're going to wait until later when I decide what I want to do. I also want to change the fireplace because I'm not quite sure that I like the brick look anymore. Thinking maybe like a German smear, like over grouting or something like lime wash. I don't know yet, but that will come in the future someday, but not right now. But overall, I am so happy with how this turned out. What do you guys think? Leave your comments below. I definitely want to hear your opinion. If you like it, if you don't like it, if you like how I did the TV stand or decorated the living room, I want to know your opinions. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Bye!